welcome back to my channel today I will be doing a what's in my bag with my new smorga organizer for my st. Laurent Reef gauche tote so my smorga organizer just came in this is actually my first um, smorga organizer but I've watched all the review videos I know that this is like the go-to in the handbag world so I'm really excited to try this one out I'm also really excited for this one because um, if you saw my unboxing and I'll leave a link below, um, I'm just concerned with the shape of the bag and so I'm really excited to have something in there to help keep it shape. So it looks like it comes with some felt pouches so that's actually kind of cute in different colors. I don't know what these are used for. If y'all know y'all can let me know. So this organizer has two pockets. So you have two smaller pockets on one side with a pen holder and then you have two larger pockets on the other, and then you also have a bottle holder. Um, but yeah, so we are going to grab my tote and put this inside and see how it fits. So let me clear the trash out. This is also really light. Again, if you saw my review video, I mentioned how um, I was just concerned I'm concerned about weight with this bag because you have to carry it on your arm or use it as a handbag but what I do like is that this is very lightweight so um, it doesn't add much or if any um, weight to the bag so that's actually really nice so I think it looks good in here I know it's black on black um, but I think the lighting is adjusting pretty well so that y'all can see it um, I personally was thinking about doing white just so you can see everything inside, but I just know it would bother me if it was like a white interior and then all black. I just, I'll struggle with the blindness. <laughs> um, so first thing we're gonna add in here is my water bottle. And let me just make sure that this is closed. So this is the Chanel Factory 5 water bottle. I'm just gonna slide that in to the pouch. And then I have my Chanel key holder. And so this is my wallet. Um, I don't want it to shift around inside of here and so I'm just gonna tuck it in here and that's where I like to keep it so I can easily grab it whenever I'm purchasing items um, I think this is essentially a reverse what's in my bag um, and then I have my six key holder from Louis Vuitton with all of my keys and so we're just gonna close that and then I think I'm just gonna tuck it in on the side. Um, so we're just gonna put this in here and that way it's kind of close to my wallet. And that'll help me remember too, like if my wallet's on the side, my keys are on the side. Um, we have my personal phone. There's a pen holder, so let me grab a pen. So I have my favorite pen, which is the Uniball Signo. I think it's the 0.75. Um, I'll link everything that I can link below. Um, so there's those items. So those are like the essentials that I always need. I also have sunglasses. So I like tucking everything in that can be tucked in. Um, so I'm going to put that on the side. However, I do want to see, because I don't always carry a water bottle, if it fits in the bottle. Yeah, so they do fit in the bottle holder. So I think if I don't carry a water bottle, that's where I will put um, my sunglasses. But for the purpose of this video, we'll put it in there. And then I have my Louis Vuitton GM cosmetic pouch. And because this is technically a what's in my bag, um, I'm still gonna share everything that I keep inside. So I have my lip balm from Chanel Double Mirror Compact. Um, I started carrying UV essential on me because I don't put this on in the morning. I have the Coco Mademoiselle purse spray. So I've been switching between this and the Chanel Factory 5 Leal purse spray. I keep my hand cream in here. Um, I have Advil. I have um, Tide to Go. That's a new addition because I was traveling and I just haven't taken it out. Um, for this too, I keep the lint roller in here. However, um, that's downstairs and I didn't want to go grab it. But I will keep the lint roller that I use for this bag to help keep it clean in here. Um, I have eyeliner. So I have three of these So because I lost an eyeliner, bought another, forgot to pack it when I went on my most recent trip, 
bought another and then found the initial one so i'm just keeping one full eyeliner in here otherwise i keep the samples in here now because it has less weight so i just have the different samples that you get at chanel and then there were bobby pins and hair ties in this compartment however i feel like they're just shifting around at the bottom of the bag but um that is everything i believe i hit everything um and that's what i like to keep in the pouch and we're just going to put that in over here and then recently i also purchased the saint laurent clutch and so i was initially looking at the pouch and i'll have that video linked below but i was initially looking for the matching pouch so that i could use that pouch for um like my wallet if i want to leave this somewhere if you saw my review video i mentioned how this bag is really heavy or at least um, it's a lot to carry on your arm, especially if you use it for work or travel or school. And so I wanted to buy a pouch or a clutch so that I can just um, leave this at my desk and then take that out if I need to go to um, lunch or if I want to like just run somewhere and just need my stuff um, and just leave this by my desk. So I saw this clutch because it was only a little bit more and I thought it was perfect. And so um, this is also perfect for if I want to use this as a work bag. I have a bag to go to happy hour with afterwards and I don't have to worry about carrying this big tote. But I'm just going to put this in here. And then last item that I keep in all my bags is my Louis Vuitton Pasha accessory. Prior to this clutch, I was using this as a like on the go grab bag. However, I just wanted something that matched this bag. And just in case I didn't want to have um, the monogram and just I wanted something a little bit more simple. So... I purchased that but I still use this to hold everything so right now I have my small agenda from Louis Vuitton and I have been using this as a like on the go planner and I'm going to turn it into on the go slash daily planner so I'm going to add daily inserts in here and then I just also have my key card holder in here and this has all of my additional like store cards and extra gift cards and different things like that and then I'd probably put this in here if not does it tuck in here yeah honestly probably tuck it in here um if i use this i don't know i feel like i wouldn't use this in here if i have the clutch it would be one or the other so i'm just gonna put the small agenda sorry guys i keep hitting the camera um so i'm just gonna put the small agenda in the side pocket so y'all can see what that looks like although i feel like it should be closer to the pen so let's move the phone and put this over here and then for the keep out slash my card holder i'm just going to tuck it in with the phone or i can leave it loose or figure it out at a different time so that is what i plan to carry whenever i use this as like an everyday tote and so it just has all of the essentials and everything has its spot i'm really excited for the organizer i have been using this less one because i wanted the organizer to come in so that'll help keep the shape of the bag but also because because this bag is so big without an organizer things get lost very quickly and i've been like scrambling and minimizing items that i keep in here to the point that it defeats the purpose of using the bag so i've been waiting for this to come in to really fully use this bag so that is the setup and what i generally carry so that is going to be it for this video if y'all have any questions please feel free to let me know and thank you guys so much for watching.